Today we become seasoned foodies. Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. And we've had a lot of spicy stuff on this show, stuff that humans should not consume. Yeah. We do it for your entertainment, but spicy doesn't always mean hot. Sometimes spice is just the spice of life, just mm -hmm. adds flavor, but where does that flavor come from? I don't know, let's find out. Mm, yes, we'll be tasting a wide variety of spices and herbs <laughs> from around the world yeah. uh, and seeing if we can pinpoint the two uh, using the points on darts. Oh. Let's do it! Where in the world do these international spices come from? Okay, so we're going to taste a spice, and then we are going to guess where that spice comes from by throwing a dart at- oh. Oh, oh my goodness! Why did you do that? <laughs> what Sorry. in the world is I didn't, wrong with you? Give me a heads up, man! I didn't know you were moving over there! You could, it <laughs> could have totally gone through his freaking arm! We don't- I'm a cartographer, I'm not a dartboard! <laughs> Chase has to use those hands to measure Chase, things sorry. with, man. Woo! Chase, I'm sorry, uh, man. It's not gonna make up for it. I'm sorry. He's almost hurt me so many times and injured me so many times that I'm not surprised. But are you, are you Chase, you okay? <laughs> I'm so. surprised you didn't say more than you said. I'm trying to be nice for the fans. Anyway, Chase is still okay. Did you catch that? Did you miss that? We got it. So as I was trying to say, we're going to guess what country it comes from by throwing a dart at the board. And of course, the closer you get, the better it is. So the further you get away, the worse it is. Chase, our ill-fitting uh, shirt-wearing cartographer who is totally healthy right now. <laughs> we'll measure it and points are bad. Centimeters equals points, points are bad. Are you ready? Have the, you recovered? The, the lose, I, yeah, I'm, I'm very shook up by that. Uh. But thank you for being concerned for me. Uh. I will be okay. Uh, the loser has to eat a 20 Five spice milkshake uh, in the conclusion of this. Let's get to it. Okay, so we're gonna have all our spices brought in on a spice rack. It. There it is. <laughs> See that? Okay, we've got the spices loaded into these tennis balls. This one looks like. Sugar? Flour? Dirt. Oh, it feels like flour. Mm. Oh, I've tasted this before. It's floral. It tastes kind of like gingerbread. Yeah. Mm. Where in the world would this be? There's only one way to try to find out. All right, you won last time we did this, so that means you get to dart first. Well, I already darted, but that was that was a <laughs> premature darted? dart. Okay. Um, man. Well, I'm from the USA, and I haven't really tasted that. I can't imagine the dish that that would be in. Like, what kind of sauce would that be in? Because here's what I'll say. It's not spicy. Yeah, it's not really strong. It doesn't strong. have a bite to it, so I don't think it's gonna come from like <clears throat> India or Brazil, Namibia, that area. This this seems like something some some cold white people would enjoy. <laughs> so that right. is uh, Iceland or Norway, best guess that I've got. So I'm gonna aim right between them. Oh, or way up there. <laughs> went kinda high. Chase, I, I can't help but notice that you're way <laughs> back here now. You want to get in a little bit? I'm fine over here. Okay. All right. So you're gonna stay there. Yeah. I'll be and right I'm gonna here. throw this. Uh -huh. I'm only gonna throw one. And I'm gonna throw it. I mean, it tastes like gingerbread. I mean, I've had that. You've had that in the U.S. Yeah. Okay. Or you had it oh, in the, the Ivory Coast. The Cote d'Ivoire. <laughs> okay, guys. This is called Maleb, and it's cultivated from the seeds of a particular sour cherry tree, used widely as an ingredient in the desserts from Iran. 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 You're Iran. Little, I think you're, hmm, we're about even. I might be a little closer because of my bad aim. Chase? <laughs> Rhett, you had 30. Link, 27. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Neck and neck. Out of the gate. All right, another spice. Another well, On this, the rack. Okay, this one's seedy. This, one, this one's dark. I go, I go soft on looks this Looks like one. snuff. Hmm. Hmm. Kind of looks peppery. Smells peppery. It tastes like something was like scraped off the bottom of a shoe. Tastes oh, like, isn't it? Whoa! Tastes like pepper. Secondarily, pepper. Well, it's getting. Whoa! <laughs> what? What is that? What is that happening? Oh, what is that happening? That's taste happening. Mm, You're tasting okay. it. And there's a little spice there. It's very peppery. I feel at, very confident about where this is from. At first, it was very potpourri. 
I feel mm. very confident about this one. Mm. There's a spice here. <laughs> Doesn't mean anything. Man, though. you rub. I just feel like I'd rub this on some meat and then like this. Grill it. That's a big piece of meat. Yeah. What kind of meat and is that you're rubbing? It? Brazilian meat. Oh, Brazilian meat. Whoa, you almost actually hit the country. That would have been a first. Well, All right. I was aiming for it. Can you move back a little bit? Sure, brother. I'm going for the Côte d'Ivoire, which mm. is French for the Ivory Coast. Oh, oh, little high. I'm high into the right today, consistently. All right. Stevie, what's the verdict? Okay, guys, this is Tasmanian pepper. It's a rare peppercorn often used in traditional food like emu burgers and kangaroo steaks. I knew it would be good on meat. Australia. Australia. Ooh, man, that so was on the right track, but those Brazilians, they get the ch churrascaria? Churrascaria. Churrascaria. Yep. Chase? Rhett has 56. Link has 62. Oh, Ooh, I got back some points. Taking the lead, right? Took a small lead. Uh, okay. You're gonna get that big nut. And I'll, well, it's a crushed nut. So let's both go with the crushed side. Well, it's that's a, on your, that's your ball, man. It's a crushed version your of Your ball, your nut. <laughs> so you want me, so I'm a no, no, you don't have to. You don't, okay. Do what you want to. Ooh. What in the world? Like mothballs. Yeah, tastes like something. Do you, ah! This is a preservative. This is a preservative. How do you even consume that? Ugh. That's a. You, you like it? I hate it, but I want to know what it is. It's got a vanilla aftertaste to it. That's the weird thing. Is that like it's mothballs with a with a vanilla center? Where would they like this? Mm. Grab your dart, brother. You're gonna have to weigh in first. It's a. It's just such an unusual taste. And where would they need to preserve something? India. <sighs> High into the right, consistently. You think they need to preserve more things in India than anywhere else? Yeah, they don't preserve anything anywhere else. <clears throat> they, you know, they, up there in Norway and Iceland around those Arctic regions, they like, they bury stuff and then it ferments and yeah, that's then true, you like. sprinkle that nastiness on it mm -hmm. and then somehow it all balances out. Yep. But I don't know. Throw it in the middle then. I'm going for the middle. <laughs> oh, I hope, it, hope it's Italy. Yeah, <laughs> I don't think it's Italy. You are on the right track with vanilla because these are tonka yeah. beans and they're used as a substitute for vanilla. They're also considered to be magical and they're used in love magic and money spells. Money spells I and love I magic? I thought I was feeling something after eating that. In Brazil. Brazil. Uh, well, Lots okay. of money That's magic. That's good news for you, Link. Bad Love. news for me. <laughs> Link, you had 29, and Rhett, 54. Ooh, that hurts. Yeah. All right. Okay, uh, I see what they're doing now. They're showing you the hole on your side and then the spice on okay. my side. So I can eat you, off of so this side eat, this time? You can eat off my ball. Your royal highness. All right, so, ooh. You did a pinch, huh? I did a pinch. I pinched it. This tastes like an Italian seasoning is my first thing. It's like, it tastes like tea to me. It's got a tea taste, a spicy tea. It doesn't really taste like an oregano type spice. It You get that at first. Hmm. This is, this I mean, is, no, 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 you go first. We'll see what you do. Chase is, <laughs> Chase is trying to flee the scene because I grabbed a dart and he <laughs> tripped, tripped over the thing. All right, so I'm not going with you for Italy here, I'm actually gonna take a, a big honking risk. Big honking risk? Mm, I'm thinking Japan. You can think that. What, hey, your throws are great today, by the yeah. way. Yeah, thank you. I don't know how your, your guessing is, is okay, but your throws are great. <laughs> um, what okay. do you think, you think in Italy? I think, oh, this is such a big risk, because I'm, th I'm about thinking about going for a USA, <laughs> because I feel like- USA! Because I love USA, my country. USA, USA! My country's got USA. spice! USA! USA. They're not gonna just bring out like pepper for for USA. I feel like this is oh, like. Do you think this tricky tricky? This is like a bay leaf ish thing. So okay, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna go for the USA. Oh, what? I almost hit Florida. Florida. Dang it! I think you're gonna hate yourself for this one because these are myrtle leaves, and the whole leaf is used to infuse marinades and sauces in Italy. Oh, oh you gosh, are, man! Your original. Ah. I swayed you. We're both we're both like polar opposites. Well, not at the poles, but all right. Thirty-two for Rhett and thirty-nine for Link. Ooh, okay. six degree difference. Well, seven actually. 
Okay, more spice. Spice of life. Spice. Ooh, Ooh this one is. You don't. This one is colorful. Ooh, that's gonna be hot. I think. This is spicy. That's a spice tasting sound. No, you gotta keep. No, yeah, keep the mouth closed. <laughs> it helps, doesn't it? Didn't uh, the country go straight to your brain when you did that? For me, it did. Oh, it did. Yeah, I know exactly what country Ooh, this is. I chewed up some of those green things. Those are like nutty seeds. I've I've <laughs> cracked the case. It's <laughs> nutty seeds. <laughs> Ah, okay, mm. all right. You're going first this time? Yeah, so my instinct is Namibia. Because? When I did the <laughs> Namibia was formed, I almost poked myself right in the eyeball. That Namibia formed bad. in my. So I'm going to Namibia. I'm going to, on a one way trip to Namibia. Or oh. the Ivory Coast. <laughs> now, interestingly enough, I actually think this is Cote d'Ivoire. Oh, really? Well, so aim now, for it then. So now I gotta aim for that in order to like, Maintain my lead. Okay. Is is it, I don't know. It, the orangeness made me think India, but it didn't taste like Indian food. Man, it could be India. Could be anything. What do we know? Oh, it could be Namibia. <laughs> <laughs> that was, we right. switched. Yeah, we did. <laughs> okay, bear with me for this one. This is Shishimi Togarashi, or Seven Spice, which That's dates back to the 17th century herbal medicine shops. And guess where it's from? Japan. 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 Ooh, we were both. I would have very never wrong. anticipated that being from Japan. Never. Link, you had 45. Rhett, you had 49. Ooh, oh, yeah. wow, this is a tight <laughs> game, man. <laughs> Okay, Rat, going into the final round, you have to get 20 centimeters to win. Closer you're, you're up by than me. Hey, to it's win. any man's game. 20 centimeters is not a lot on a big world, big map. Okay, now there's a big nut on that you side. You eat this one. I, whoa. Huh. But you know, I, I do think, like like what seed. kind of tree would that nutty seed come from? What kind of country would that be? Smell, let me smell it. Let me smell it. Let me smell it. it smells like a big pepper. It looks like it has salt and pepper in it. It's a salt and pepper nut. How have I not heard of a salt and pepper nut? What is this? I mean, this is so, ooh, it gets spicy in a second. Who's going first on this one? Me. I know where I'm aiming, but I don't wanna say anything because the, the game is on the line. Mm-hmm. First of all, this is like a very tree-ish pepper. I feel like I'm eating a tree. But I do like it. It's got a, a definite kick to it. Mm -hmm. I can see that making some flavorful dishes. Mm. This is tough. So we haven't been to USA, Iceland, Norway, India, or Namibia. We, or haven't, we haven't been to either African country. No, we haven't. I think this is a coastal thing. Okay. Plus it's kind of in the middle of the map, so I'm hedging my bets here. I Whoa, you're on fire, yeah. Lynn. What do you I, think this is? Tell me, since it, since uh, there's I, nothing I can do. I think this is USA. I think this you is, do? I think it's pepper. I just think it's pepper, you but think it's a big corn. It's a big old corn. It's a big pepper corn? It's a big old pepper corn. USA, USA! Oh, or Canada. All right. You were right because it is pepper. It's alligator pepper. It's a highly sought after spice used in a variety of ways for baby welcoming ceremonies, naming ceremonies, meet and greets, in the Ivory Coast. Oh, you did it, Lee! Yes! You I took it home. It. <laughs> mm. I'm, you know, I'm coming to you, Ivory Coast. I love it there. I haven't even been, but those big old peppercorns and baby showers, those are my two favorite in. things. One at a time. I'm going to enjoy a 25 spice milkshake. Oh, but I'm not going to enjoy it. Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And once again, Chase, I am sorry. Man. Yes, you know what time it is. Hi, I'm Nello from Namibia, and this is my sister. Ashley. And this is my other sister. Jane. And, and it's, it's time, time to spin the wheel of mythicality. I'm going to enjoy this 25 spice milkshake, but you can enjoy seeing how it was made if you watch Good Mythical Crew on this channel every Saturday. Including tomorrow, which is Saturday. Which is the one where you can see how this is made. Clint to good He's going to eat that. Get to Cali. Woo! All right, that means we're gonna be donating $1,000 to the American Refugee Committee to help them in their mission to provide refugees with health, education, shelter, and protection services. Join us in giving at arcrelief.org. Thank you for being your mythical best. 
Click on the left to watch our show after the show, Good Mythical More. Click on the right to watch another episode of Good Mythical Morning. And click the circular channel icon to subscribe. Thanks for being your mythical best.